Welcome to Schulte and Swan Halftime, listeners. The multiple award-winning Schulte and Swan Marching Band, under the baton of Director of Bands, Dr. Scott Schulte, featuring music director Greg Young, have been exploring topics that are hard, backslash, difficult all season long. And this morning, it being Black Friday, the band has shopping on its mind. And as a matter of fact, as soon as they're done with this halftime show, it's Anchors Away. What will they be shopping for? Well, the organization WATCH, which stands for World Against Toys Causing Harm, a nonprofit group of nanny state fun haters, has come up with several toys they warn can cause anything from allergic reactions to blunt force injury and choking hazards. For example, they don't like these completely awesome-sounding razor-sharp Jurassic World Velociraptor claws because the oversized claws can cause facial injuries to four-year-olds. Come on, four-year-olds. You're ruining it for the band. Do you know what these toys can mostly cause? Fun, fun, fun. Okay, here's a red hot toy the band actually does think needs to be banned, and the quicker the better. Because Arlene, the super fluke flute hawk, has about 14 of them stuck in her hair right now. They are called bunchums. And one Amazon reviewer describes them as a toy spawned from the darkest depths of hell. <laughs> the concept is a good one. Interlocking, squishy, plastic, spherical little bursts that can be used to construct whatever the child imagines. Until they get into your hair, that is. Another Amazon reviewer says, perfect gift for that child you hate. Have a five-year-old who really gets on your nerves? Then give them this and let them play with it unsupervised. The real problem with bunchums is they can't turn you loose.
for the band. I'm announcer's name saying enjoy the Shorty and Swan second half and go Hawkeye. It's great to be a Hawkeye. Z102.9.